Christian couples to watch pornographic films. Let me read something to you from the Bible first. Habakkuk chapter 2 from verse 15. It says, Woe unto him that giveth his neighbor drink, that putteth thy bottle to him, and makest him drunken also, that thou mayest look on their nakedness. Thou art filled with shame for glory. Drink thou also, and let thy foreskin be uncovered. The cup of the Lord's right hand shall be turned unto thee, and shameful spewing shall be on thy glory. Now, the implication of that is that uh, one's nakedness being made public is a shame when you're not a child as far as God is concerned that's a shame now that started from the Garden of Eden you remember the Bible tells us that Adam and Eve were in the garden God placed them in the garden and then when they did what God said not to do by obeying uh, Satan the Bible tells us that their eyes were open and they found out that they were naked. And then they covered themselves with leaves because they found they were naked. They were ashamed and they hid themselves from God. Which means it's natural to try to hide one's nakedness, one's physical nakedness. And what did God do? God didn't say, oh, don't worry. You can move around like that. No, the Bible tells us that God slew an animal and gave them the skin of the animal to cover themselves instead of the leaves. So God recognized that nakedness as giving uh, a feeling of shame. That's why I read that scripture to you. Now the question we ought to be asking is, what is the purpose of pornographic films in the first place? Why are they produced? And what is the meaning? When you say pornographic films, I hope you know what you're talking about. The word pony is from late Greek, meaning prostitute. And when you say pornographers, it's a writing about prostitutes. So it has something to do with some form of uh, um, some form of debased human life you see so it's not something of honor it's not something of glory it's something of shame why produce it it means it is done for a reason and whatever that reason is it's obvious that it's not positive Christians don't do it. Those who believe in Jesus don't do it. They don't produce those kind of films because they understand there is a, a, a shamefulness in nakedness. When you study from Genesis all the way to the end of the Bible, Revelation, you discover the same trend. The same trend. So it's not right. There will be no positive reason to use it, understanding the reason for which it was produced. It was produced by those who want others to have a feeling that they could have a prostituted life. See, and that's what the word actually refers to. So for that reason, I would say that Christian couples, or any Christian for that matter, should not use pornographic material. It's not wise.